Hey guys, it's Todd Bartusek with Berkshire Hathaway Real Estate and the All Metro Real Estate Group. So coming to you again, we're gonna give you the April report for the Omaha market, and this is existing, no new construction, and this is Douglas and Sarpy County. So uh, big numbers, guys, right? So we had a huge April. We had 688 closings. That was up 12% from March, um, and prices are on the move. This is overall. So our average sale price in March was 333,000. Our average sale price in April was 344,000. So up almost three and a half percent. So big numbers. And our sales went from 614 to 688. That's also, uh, I mean, that's a big number. That's up 12%. So. Uh, Inventory, we're getting more inventory coming in, but we still have plenty of buyers. And uh, as you can see, overall in one month, almost three and a half percent jump. For an average sale price right now in the in the Omaha area of $344,299. Um, so uh, now I'm gonna go to the move up, or excuse me, the, the first time home buyer price point. That's zero to 350,000. So we went from 428 sales in March to 459 in April. That was an increase of 7%. Again, great uh, great signs, right, that the market is still continuing to move. Um, our price, uh, uh, average sale price was up 2.9% from 241,600 uh, to 248,5. Um, days on market were about a week and a half. So when your house goes on the market, it's gonna sell pretty quick and it's gonna sell for a good price. Um, that's a zero to 350, which is the first time home buyer price point. The next one is uh, what I like to call the move up. That's 350 to 750. So uh, we were up again big in units. We went from 165 to 202 in April. That's up 22%. Uh, now our price has actually dropped a little bit. We went from 466 and some change in April to 464. So down 0.4%. Um, you know, when we start looking at the move up houses, those are gonna be houses you know, and we kind of, kind of see a glut at times where we'll see, you know, four, four fifty, five hundred. Those houses might be 20, 30 years old. You know, big houses, lots of potential, but they need work. You know, we need paint. We need, you know, maybe some minor carpentry. We need some, you know, just some cosmetics in the house. That's why I'm not saying this is consistent the last month um, is that that move up is staying fairly steady. Um, but we've got some opportunities for buyers there too. So if you if you can do a little carpet and paint, you know, kind of like the basics, you know, uh, somebody can get a good buy. Um, so then the next segment I like to talk about is the luxury. That's 750 and above. So we had 21 in March and we had 21 units in, uh, or excuse me, it's 27 units sell in April. That's 750 and above. So that's a 29% increase. Um, average sale price was down. We went from a uh, million one hundred fifty-seven thousand in March to a million seventy-five thousand. So that's down seven percent. All I can attribute that to is, you know, when the interest rates are moving, it'll have a house sit a little longer. Now, a lot of times in the upper end, we do see cash deals because um, the that luxury buyer a lot of times, you know, they are cash heavy and they are not wanting to pay 7% interest. Um, so I think that has a little bit to do with um, that price point dropping just a little bit. So anyways, overall guys, very active spring market. I mean, we're right in the middle of it, but don't, don't let it fool you. It, it'll end pretty quick because once we get into summer, that's when we start to see activity slow down. You know, we have, we have, uh, you know, lots of baseball and soccer games and people are traveling and vacations and all that. So, um, you know, if you know someone that wants to sell and get top dollar, you know, right now is a great time to do it. So if you guys ever have any questions, put my 24 years, uh, you know, to work for you um, and I can answer any questions. And obviously there's no obligation. So again, um, if you like what you see here, please follow me on social media and remember to uh, subscribe to my YouTube channel. Thanks for watching.